Okay, so let's look at the function number 22, follow. Uh, here's the output follows the trigger. So when trigger is active, the output is uh, active. So you can use it as the relay when you have a weak signal. You would connect your trigger uh, to your source and then an output will follow the trigger. And you would configure to function 22 and depends on the trigger. Um, in this case where we want to, we have the button connected to the ground so we want to make connection to the ground is active that will be trigger 4 if it's the positive signal then it will be uh, trigger number 2 so let's uh, configure it to the configure to the function uh, 22 so timing we don't need to set any timing because there's no timing here it just follow we're going to the function menu setting up a trigger to 4 and function 22 20 one, two. okay we're supplying the power push the button on off on off so the button connects the trigger to the ground if we want to reverse it we can make the output uh, come on when trigger is not active and vice versa uh, so to do that we will just need to change in our case just the trigger to function four to a five and that will make it work the opposite way so going to the into the programming mode skipping the timing and just setting up the function to uh, the trigger to a five five and supply the power we have the on when they push the button it goes off so it's a little bit of, it's the the uh, negative output or reverse output should i say okay that is it thank you